<laughs> You're right, don't choke. She's got a hot flush. I'm having a hot flush. Do we need to move around? Do we need to move around? Yeah, we need to move around. Maddie in the middle, Maddie in the middle, Maddie in the middle. I love being an embarrassing mum. I was going to say, do you ever think your mum's embarrassing? Baby all the time. Hang on, energy. someone has seen the film Split. I have. It was yeah. a really good movie, actually. Was oh. it? Well, this is a new film that everyone seems to be very, 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 very excited about, and it's called Glass. Have you heard Ooh. about it? M. Shamayalan? Do you remember Glass oh, and Split? Yes. Are you What's speaking in tongues? Split nice. And, and the boy, the boy and film. Where Sixth Sense. Sixth Sense. What are you talking about? What is it a follow on from I Split? See. I think it's a follow on from Split. What was Split? We don't know what Split was. James was. McAvoy film, film, wasn't it? Uh, James, oh, that I see Split. It's a fabulous film. Yeah. It's, it's James, good. It's, it's good. It's, uh, I want a banana split. It's a James McAvoy film and it's basically about him having split personalities and he steals these three girls and like. Oh, no, I can't see that. It's only a I saw the trailer. It was awful. No, he's good in it. He's always good. It's a brilliant film. So this has landed at San Diego. Comic Con and it's called Glass. Oh, we're not watching Split. Split Glass. <laughs> no, it's been out. Split, Split, Split Glass. Well, I think this is related to that film. Okay. All right. Poor Nads. Everybody shut I don't know what the hell's going on. I want a strawberry Split. Made sense. And a banana Split. <laughs> oh, we like oh, I love her. Oh, I'm me. It's amazing to meet you. It is simply extraordinary. Maybe this will all make sense if I explain who I am. My name is Dr. Ellie Staple, and I'm a psychiatrist. My work concerns a particular type of delusion of grandeur. It's a growing field. I specialize in those individuals who believe they are superheroes. This split. <laughs> <laughs> Good for you. Bruce. Samuel L. Jackson. The three of you've convinced yourselves you have extraordinary gifts. Samuel that Jackson! Have yeah. comic book. David Dunn, the only person to survive that train wreck all those years ago. What do you do? I'm in security. You think you have superpowers? It's a feeling. Vision. I have to touch them. You believe you are a protector. My name is Patricia. <laughs> I have no question. There are two dozen identities. I'm Mary Reynolds. Por favor, senora. We almost got you, bro. That live in that body with you. The beast is coming any minute now for you guys. But what I am questioning is your belief that you are something more than human. <laughs> and yet... It is true. My bones break easily. I've had 94 breaks in my life. But you have an extraordinary IQ. This is not a cartoon. This is the real world. No way. And yet, some of us still don't die with bullets. Some of us can still bend steel. I have been waiting for the world to see that we exist. May I meet the beast? I hope for your sake that he likes you. That sounds like the bad guys teaming up. A lot of people are going to die. Don't do this. Are you ready? What do we call you, sir? First name, Mr. Last name, Glass. Ooh. Well, I like that. Ooh. That really is so good. Doesn't it? When I saw the man that's the main one in Split, I realized that I have seen clips from it. I think that looks really bad, Split. Split looks bad. Yeah. What do you think of that one? Uh, might be too grown up for you, I think. I get it, I understand everything. I, I mean... I don't think, I sorry. thought it looked terrible. Oh, did you? Yeah. Why? I think, well, for a start, two of the people that you're talking about are collective ages, about 600, Jackson and uh, Bruce Willis. I mean, come on. They're so old. They're so heroes. 
And then the only, guy, the only guy who could possibly be is the one in the middle, James which Michael we've seen. You don't have to be young to be a superhero. No. Well, you've got to be old fit. Superheroes. You can be old and fit. But, but are, are they superheroes? Isn't the whole point that they have delusions? Exactly. Of superheroes? Yeah. The point is yes. they're questioning whether no, they're no, superheroes. No, no, I understand that. But you've got it's got to be believable. I mean, give me Thor, or even give me Aquaman rather than two. Aquaman. Aquaman. Yeah. Listen, you've got a thing about you've Aquaman. Thing about I don't think about Aquaman. Think about Aquaman. Aquaman. You can't put th Thor is a god. <laughs> He's a god. That He's bit a where he's running like a wolf. Though. That was that odd. That, 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 because <laughs> one of his personalities is the beast. The, the, bit, the only bit that I like was the very beginning of that trailer where she's talking to the camera and you think, yes. oh my God, this is serious and this is a psychiatric thing. I didn't yeah. realise at that point it was a superhero thing. No, I, I think it's breathe. clever. <laughs> <laughs> Your superhero should be the power of prayer. You can't get to the end of our sentences, sorry. And I adore Samuel Jackson. I can't just can't believe how ageist really. you are. How I old know. are you? Yeah. 100. Yeah, and you, and you do Pilates and everything. So, like, I'm you not. Do I, don't, I don't call myself a superhero. I, I, I have a bit of a love hate relationship with Bruce Willis. I'm always willing him to yeah. be much funner in his oh, kind of Bruce comeback. Bruce Willis is fantastic. Well, There's nobody like Bruce Willis to no, deliver a witty line. Isn't there? Do you remember that series he was in? Him and that oh, woman. Oh, Moonlighting. Yeah, Sister Shepherd. Yeah, he wasn't. No, yeah, you don't that. know what you're talking about. Say yeah, that about well, Bruce Willis. Yeah, but they yeah. just, we just, we just didn't see anybody. But he there. came back no, in a film true. called Looper, directed by <laughs> Rian Johnson, who destroyed the Star Wars franchise. But Looper um, wasn't as bad oh, as you said. Yeah, but Bruce, Bruce, Bruce Willis wasn't good in it. Oh, I didn't no, say that. Well, wasn't wasn't no, it wasn't good in it. Because the director you just spat about. Yeah, yeah. Ryan Willis, Johnson. Bruce Willis is a brilliant comic. Has fantastic comic timing. I agree. Has always been good. I'm really, really, really. Like the look of that. I like I'm it. seeing I it like as soon as it comes out. Oh, tell so me more about why you liked it. So I just like the idea and everything. Because usually films at the moment, they're all very samey. Yes. It's something that's done, been done oh, okay. before. Yeah, yeah. And they haven't done this before. That's and it's true. good because they aren't massive. Well, they obviously aren't massive superheroes because I wouldn't. Because mm. they're too Split, old. I wouldn't call him a superhero. Yeah. yeah. Call him with some. Personality mental. disorder. Yeah. yeah. Um, I, I think it looks really clever. And, and the has, acting looks really good as well. And I think James McAvoy really is a guilty pleasure. I mean, he is. He's, 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 he's he's well, I was going to say, come on, excuse me, James McAvoy, who I adore, Samuel Jackson, who we mm. all adore, adore yeah. Yeah. Bruce Willis, who I'd like to see back in front. Yeah, yeah. no, he's I great. Would, I would. He's great. Yeah. Really? And, and the sorry, woman I... from Bridesmaids. Apparently. Yeah, the woman from so Bridesmaids. Like in the Which I woman? I was so confused. Did she look like Kate Wick? The main woman in She thinks she looks like Kristen Wiig. She's looking at like Kristen Wiig. Also, oh, James McAvoy was my first love. Was he? When he played the half goat man in Narnia. Oh, me too. I felt <laughs> oh, really yes. good. Yes, yes, I bet yes. I yes. fell for him in Shameless. He was gorgeous in Shameless. He was, yeah, yeah, but then he. I fell for him in Filth. Which I think is probably one of the Filth most brilliant the most British films film. yes. made in recent years. It's a fabulous Check film. it out. It's very yeah, rude and inappropriate for the youngies, but um, written great. by Welsh, who wrote to yeah. Irving Welsh, Irving Welsh. Yeah, it's it's very good. You've seen You've it. You've seen it. No, no, no. I think I have. Okay. Okay. Oh. Have you seen it? Can you I don't know what anyone's talking about. <laughs> <laughs>